This is a demonstration video of the Bush record player. I'm just going to show you how to use it so you'll be familiar with it when you receive it. When you receive it, the first thing to do is screw down the two transit screws on the deck located here and here. Screw those all the way down fully clockwise so the deck floats on its springs and remember to unclip the arm. Three main controls are on the right hand side for on, off, volume, bass and treble and they can be adjusted with the lid either open or closed via the slots on the side. On the deck you have the switch for manual or automatic start and speed and size combination for 7 inch 33, 12 inch 33, 7 inch 45 or 10 inch 78. You can load between 1 and 6 records, I'll demonstrate with 2 just so you can see it play. Pop the records onto the spindle edge and put the stacker arm across and flick the switch to auto to start the auto changer. switch to auto again if you want to skip to the next record. So I'll demonstrate with the start of a 12 inch record as well. the arm lifts off automatically when it reaches the end of the record. If you don't want to use the auto changer and you just want to play one record manually at a time, then you can just place an individual record down the spindle onto the platter and select the manual option and just place the arm onto the record yourself. Once the arm is on the record and it's playing, lower the stacker arm down so it knows to switch off automatically when it reaches the end of the record. If you leave it playing with the stacker bar left in the upright position as pictured here, that triggers the repeat function and the same record plays over again. On the front are also the sockets for adding an additional amplifier and tape recorder, and those are via a DIN socket lead. So I hope that covers everything for you. If you do have any questions when you receive it, I'll include my personal email address in with the machine, and please use that method to contact me.